Hi, I'm Lima. Welcome to my channel. Let's talk about luxury. So, today we're going to talk about another Rolex 2013 Basel World and Rolex came with a new GMT Two-tone bezel, black and blue People call it immediately the Batman Two-tone GMTs for Rolex was nothing new In the past uh, we had uh, the two-tone with uh, red and blue and people called them the, the watch, the Pepsi, and we also have in the past, and I hope uh, that watch uh, come back to the collection, uh, to turn with black and red, and people call them uh, the cook. This watch was a hit. Besides the only difference from the normal uh, GMT at that time, um, that was the two-tone bezel, and uh, the two-time zone was in blue, and the normal stainless steel was in green uh, this watch was exactly the same but uh, there's something about this two-tone that uh, turns this watch very uh, special to use I love this watch um, and I can understand why there was such a hip uh, about uh, the, the watch it's a very elegant watch and I love this two-tone um, this two-tone bezel uh, with the black and blue, very, very, very nice uh, and people went crazy with this watch. This watch was discontinued. Uh, this watch came in 2013, last year uh, Rolex discontinued this watch. Now we have um, the same version, version of the watch but with a Jubilee bracelet instead of the Oyster. I personally prefer the bracelet in the Oyster. It gives a more sporty uh, look to the to the watch. Also, you have the brush on the on the sides and polish uh, links. Uh, so very nice watch. I love to use this this watch, and I definitely prefer to the um, to the Jubilee bracelet that now. Uh, not only comes with the uh, Batman that with that uh, uh, Jubilee bracelet people call him the the Batgirl, but also the Pepsi comes with the Jubilee bracelet. So uh, a big difference. Serious collectors have this watch in in their collection. Um, this is a not easy to to find watch. Um, it's a very hard watch to to, to find. Um, this watch is a GMT, you have a two time zone, uh, you also can control a third uh, time zone with a rotated bezel, then uh, you can adjust uh, a third time zone, um, but you, you will see very high collectors using this watch because it goes well with anything you, you, you are wearing. Um, you can dress it with a suit, uh, more sporty look, so very nice watch and it's not an easy watch to see some, someone using. So, exclusivity is also a very nice thing to have in, in watches and you, you will have that with the, with the Batman. 40mm uh, watch, very nice, not too big, not too small. This because has the maxi case tends to wear a little bit uh, bigger than uh, the 40 mm suggest, but is a very elegant and nice watch to to wear. You also have uh, 100 meters of water resistance, and this mechanism has uh, 48 hours of power reserve. About prices, you have to pay this the exclusivity of having a Batman. Uh, this watch, like I told you, was discontinued. I did some research on online and I found this watch uh, between 15,000 euros and 20,000 euros. This tells me one thing. This watch is going to rise on price because still having a lot of demand for the watch. Uh, 
this this watch was discontinued and because uh, having people asking 20,000 euros uh, tells me that when the the lowest price uh, of this watch uh, was uh, sold people will start to have to pay uh, for the the prices people are asking um, rounding the 20,000 euros so if you want to buy this watch if this watch is in your wishing list i advise you to to buy it as soon as possible because price is going to uh, go crazy with with this watch and soon we will have uh, some news from uh, rolex um, they probably in the next month will announce uh, the new watches from for 2021 20, uh, um, i'm curious to see what they are going to bring new but um, this is a very nice watch to to have in any collection and if you want to buy it i advise you to pull the trigger now and buy this watch so if you like this watch please give me a like also share with your friends and subscribe to my channel thank you see you next time take care ciao